Welcome back, besties. I feel like this is gonna be a different video though. I don't know. Cause it's book tour time. <laughs> It is Tuesday. We are waiting for the bus. Yeah, somewhere in Cologne. Somewhere, somewhere in Cologne, we are waiting for a bus. Um, and we will go to a handful of different bookstores because we are book girlies. We will have you like take you along. We'll see how it goes. Yes. We will probably buy some books, even though I shouldn't. I shouldn't be. She will buy books. I will buy one book maybe. Even though I would love to buy a couple hundred, but you know, money is tight, broke uni student life, doing what we do. And I have to get home at some point and I don't have the space to carry like 25 books home with me. So. I mean, I can always give you like a bag. Yeah, but no. I'm not gonna do the three bag thing. I did that last time. It's a long Hmm. I'm old. Um, but yeah, that's the vibes. Do we do an outfit check? I'm not gonna take off my coat, but we can. Let's do that. Okay, damn. So who starts? You start. Okay, so I have this new jumper. It's from Vinted. Very nice. My pink Martins and my coat. Very nice. We got whoop, whoop. we we got the it's Adidas to two thousands, I think. Very nice. We got we got jeans with the graffiti stuff on. I like fan, like freaky fancy pants, I don't know. And we have like a like a normal black jumper and top whatever on. The jacket, I don't know, I got it from my mama. And we have to be prepared because it's Germany still, so we got an umbrella. That's to fit people. That's what's popping. We just finished up in like the first bookstore. I mean, technically it's the second, yeah. but you know, uh, it wasn't giving so much. So now we'll, we'll mean, move it on. it was like picturesque. Yeah, it was nice but, to look at, like, but like it just wasn't, just wasn't ours. Yeah. It was more like art and 
like very architecture and stuff. sociology, yeah. philosophy, yeah, architecture. And very much German, so yeah. not what we do around here, but we are off to the next one. Let's hope it's better, like way, way, way better. We did. Each. That was a, a lot of self control. But then again, the thing is, we went to more like independent bookstores, so yeah. they didn't really have a big English selection, and we both tend to read English books yeah. or the German ones. Um, so and they are most likely more expensive, which oh yeah makes sense. Mm -hmm. But like, if you can get it for like half the price, sometimes you're not gonna buy it for twenty five bucks. Let's be yeah. real. Okay, do you want to start? Um, okay, so first off, I bought. Uh, what is it called? Beautiful World by Ayu by Sally Rooney. It's, it's very pretty. Very pretty cover. The thing is, um, I tried reading Conversations with Friends, but I didn't really like it. Because, mm. like, I don't know, the writing just wasn't really it for me. And also, yeah. like, I feel like it doesn't really have a plot. <laughs> I haven't I read mean, it, so the I thing don't is, know. I mean, people always say Sally Rooney books, have, they're just like vibes, no plot. But I just didn't like it, so I didn't finish it and might pick it up again. But I just thought this yeah. cover was so nice. And like from the way it's described, I don't think it has to do with cheating. Hmm. And for me, conversations with friends was very like bordering on cheating. And I have very strong negative feelings about that. Yeah. So just wasn't a vibe Relatable. for me. Relatable. And, and also, mm -hmm. I said if she does... I mean, I haven't read Sally Rooney, so yeah. we don't know yet. But I want to read one of her books very soon. Mm -hmm. And I said, if I do like Sally Rooney and she dislikes it, I will buy it off of her mm. because the cover is very pretty. Yeah. So we're winning either way. Yes. And then I bought Love Marriage by um, Monica Ali. Ali. The thing is, I don't like the the size. Yeah, it's, it's a big one. It's too big. Yeah. But the thing is, and that's why I bought it. I mean, it was on my list, like on my wish yeah. list. Yeah, it was. Oh, I didn't know. Um, but like it wasn't too high up, but then I saw it and it, it's a signed version, yeah, like a signed copy. So I was like, maybe that's my sign to like get a signed book. And for being signed, yeah. it was also like a yeah. good price, I mean, it was 20 euro, which I mean, it's a bit more expensive than I usually yeah. like books to be, but I mean, it's a it's big, a big one. one, it's signed, yes. it was the only one that they had, so yeah, maybe okay. put that one in front of it so people can see oh. how big it is. Like, it's very big, yeah, like that's big. like normal size book but yeah. it's it's very tall and also it's like a lot of pages it's like very it's it doesn't really sit well in your hands i feel like it has it's like almost weird. like comic book size yeah kind but of too of. many pages yeah facts yeah i mean i don't read comics so Me i don't, wouldn't know but it is what it is okay so that was that and i got this one i don't know the title the her majesty not. the queen investigates Whence or not. And the thing is, I like reading crime stuff. And I saw this um, and I was like, oh, it's about royals. And it looked like it was like a nice, cozy feel crime, yeah. like a feel good, nice, like a light, cozy crime read. And I feel like that's like very nice. And I mean, it's sweet. It's got the little dog on there and stuff. So I felt like it was giving. Mm. Um, and like the last couple times I read like crime stuff or anything related. It's always like the very like crazy stuff, like a lot of killing and like, I don't know. So I thought something lighthearted would be nice, you know. And then I bought The Deal by L. Kennedy. I hate the cover. It's really ugly. I, I hate the cover. But the thing is, like it's a series if you don't know. 
and everyone's been talking about it if you know steph bora love her by the way maybe she will see this one day props not but you know manifesting uh she's been talking about it as well and everyone's like loving it and so i was like maybe i need to read it and i've been looking for it but it was always like sold out or like 25 bucks and i was like that's not for me mm -hmm. and i think this time it was like 14 15 bucks so okay. an okay price and it was the last one so i felt like that was a sign for me to get it and it was also only this one and not the full series it was just this one so i took my chance and i don't know like i feel like i could like it from what i've heard like it's i don't know what it's about so it's like kind of it's like a friendship group thing mm -hmm. and like found found family i think and like all that kind of stuff it's about ho a hockey team and like i don't know it could be nice it's like college romance god knows you'd probably like it you're a romance bitch yeah i'm a romance girl and also from everything i've heard like i said it sounds like i could like it and i feel like i should read more series because i'm a standalone girl which is nice but sometimes you just need that you know when you finish a standalone it was like very great and you're just like well i would like more yeah. And so I feel like a series or two would be nice. I feel like that's the worst when you like finish a standalone. Yeah. And you know that like it was the perfect book and then you're like, okay, I'll just try something else by the author because like you like that one. And it's book. horror. And then just disappoints because it mm. might not necessarily be bad, but it just doesn't compare. Yeah, true. Or it's like sometimes not a different writing style, but it's like vibe wise, like mm. very different, just like it's yeah. not giving what it's supposed to give but yeah uh i'll see how i like it i think it could be nice but the covers are awful like very bad also on the back there's like more covers from like the the <coughs> other books and it's horrible all of them. i mean like like look at this. it just looks like very bad erotic writing yes i mean it is probably i think because, I mean, some... look at this oversized like trill i mean yeah are they even that also it's like hanging from nowhere technically yeah. it's not giving yeah, I don't, I don't know. know. The thing is, generally, I don't like people on covers. Like, if it's like a sketch, what a first line. Okay. What is the first line? He doesn't know I'm alive. Well, that that does sound mysterious. But yeah, that is the book haul. Oh, okay. But like, she's not trying to like hide off something. She's just not popular enough or something for it. Just oh, it's call. like a. I'm not the popular one. Yeah. Does he even know I exist? So I'm so different. It's <laughs> giving Wattpad, but we'll see yeah. how it goes. Maybe it's a good one. I mean, I had my Wattpad phase anyhow, so. Okay, so in the mistake, he's a player in more than, in more ways than one. Ooh. The score, he knows how to score. No, it's, it's, it's about different ones as well. I know, but still, like, just the description. Yeah. The goal. She's good at achieving her goals. I mean, who would have thought? Surprise. We'll see. I don't think no. she would like it, no, but no. I might. I mean, the thing is, I just don't like romance, which... Yeah. I don't know. It's just... A, I mean, I like rom-coms. I like watching them. But, but just not reading it. Romance books. I don't know. I just feel they're very, very awkward. With like, oh, I don't know. I just put my chest up, brown hair up in a bun. I'm just, you know? <laughs> it's, I don't know. I just feel like reading girl. it. Yeah, I just don't like it. It just feels mm. like I'm reading something written for a 12-year-old most of the time. True. Um, and then there's like unnecessary spice and you're yeah. like this sounds it's like not even written well i feel like true most of the times it's just her heat yes, <laughs> no. so i just want like crime books or like yeah i don't know non-fiction yeah but, like romance the thing is no. me as a romance girly of course i like it more than she does a lot more <laughs> a lot more but and i mean sometimes there's good spice but only sometimes and i am in a phase right now where i'm like i want the cutesy roman stuff and i don't want to like read how they do do do, do 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 like every 20 pages i just don't care i mean i think if it's like well written it yeah, can but really enhance the book but like if it's just badly written and then happens all the time it's just and also like a lot of times there's like no chemistry and no relationship yeah. and the only thing they have and do is doing the deed and that's it and i just also feel like in like romance novels it's kind of what reminds me of like YA. like the protagonist yeah. is always so self-centered yes and egoistic and it's yes. just so annoying because like then it's like oh damn 24 years old and you're just like you're behaving like a 14 year old yeah like grow up yeah and then it's just like do the authors even know what like i mean of course they're egocentric 24 year old 
books like well true but like do they even know what people that age are like probably not like, which is weird i don't know by the way the snoring sound that's the dog again yeah she's asleep she's living but yeah i don't know it's i feel like it's very 50 50. some do it well and some it's just like what is going on like who are you trying to selling this to that's also something like they write it as if they want to like get it to like 14 year olds mm -hmm. you know like a young crowd and then they put like the most outrageous spicy scenes in there and you're like that's kind of like not appropriate like the yeah. mix is weird yeah. but then yeah i also feel like with like romance authors they're weird yeah <laughs> and that's like you know if you like want to write crime or non-fiction then there's like a certain standard in a way and i feel like for romance novels everyone that standard is like so low like everyone just yeah. calls themselves romance yeah author and then true you just have all these like untalented people <laughs> look at us being judgy that's what we do yeah book connoisseurs yeah no it has it just feels weird it does and like also i feel like the chemistry in those books or in a lot of books it just feels so normal. staged True. like the conversation being like you wouldn't say it that way if you were to actually have that talk yeah nobody would about say whatever it. i mean it doesn't even have to be about like spicy stuff yeah. it can just be like they run into each other at a coffee shop and like the conversation is just so dry and like weird and then five pages later they're back at it and you're just like it doesn't make sense yeah there was no chemistry yeah. nothing like how did you end up yeah 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 or like you know when they do like um enemies to lovers or something and then there's no reason they're enemies and also they just go from like hating to just like loving each like there was yeah. nothing in between it was just like one nice thing and i was like mm. oh fair enough yeah. were you enemies or not yeah it's not giving but yeah, we'll see how it goes. Yeah. <clears throat> it might be dangerous for me to start the series. You know. But who knows when they're going to start it? <laughs> so <enough>. maybe. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. There's maybe a long time to say long money. list of books yeah. that has to happen before. What's his name? By the way. Garrett. Garrett? But like in the first page is a different one. Hannah and Garrett. Mm -hmm. okay. I so think that's the, the, that's the main main oh so she's like the not so popular one and then another not so popular guy is like oh you're into or the, the popular dude. one god knows now on the first page it's another one it's it's oh about. justin yeah yeah as you as you can see i have no idea what's going on yeah. but we'll find out so yeah that Just was a book haul i think i feel like this is also like weirdly sized because like again this is like a more like normal size and then it this is. is just a weird in between thing where it's like a bit bigger but not really big. Yeah. Mm. How big is that one compared to me? Those are like the same. Yeah, Basically. almost. Yeah. What is that? Um, anyway. But yeah, people, that was the book haul. Thank you for watching yes. the video. That's my first like outro. For real, for real. Where I say something and I'll just put the clip. <laughs> there you go. Um, have fun. Share your yes. current read in the comments. You know, so we'll see what's popping. Maybe a recommendation. Oh yeah, maybe if you have read this, please let me know what you think and if it's worth buying the whole series. Because I have an issue with buying full series before reading before it. reading it and then I hate it. I feel that. So because it's like collecting stuff. I wanna yeah. have it like full or nothing. So But then again, I mean read it and then decide if you Yeah, absolutely. I have one. also like the Shadow Me series, if you know that good for you haven't read it but i only bought the first one because i was like i'm not gonna buy like 10 books or however many it is and then it's i have it yeah. yeah no but there's like um novellas and stuff yeah, yeah. as well yeah. Those, because i feel like no it's almost more. like three or four main ones and then no i think it's three. six and then oh, five or six and there's like two or three whatever mm. it is what it is thanks for watching share your recommendations and current reads and like whatever kind of stuff hope you're doing well that was the video have fun Bye. Thank you.